Hey, great selling Saturday, folks. I hope you enjoyed your week so far. We've been talking about power statements, and I know we've probably inundated you with a whole bunch of information on that, but today is all about the sale, right? And so today we're going to get talking about what really is the sale on these Saturdays. And the answer, folks, is you, the professional housing consultant out there. You are the sale each and every day. That's what people are there to see. You may think it's about the house. You may think that they're there to see if they can even qualify for financing. But the truth of the matter is that they are there for you and because of you. How is it that you have so much influence? Well, there's really only two ways that you are going to be able to influence your customers today on Saturday to make them make a decision on purchasing the home from you. It comes down to belief and it comes down to caring. Those two things, if you're missing either one of those two today, you can just pretty much pack it up, go home, because you're not going to influence anyone. So what do I mean by belief and caring on this Saturday? Well, what I mean is if you don't believe first and foremost in yourself, no one else is gonna believe in you. But also if you don't believe in your company, if you don't believe in your product, if you don't believe in the options that you have available to these clients and how you can help them, well, it's going to come through in the way that you speak to them, whether it's on the phone or in person today and any other day. So you must have 110% belief in everything, company, product, but most importantly, in yourself because you're the sale today. Why are you not entertained? Remember that. Now, how can you earn that belief? How can you gain belief in yourself? Well, it comes down to a few things that you need to do each and every day leading up to Saturday. And not just this Saturday, but every Saturday from here on out. One, you've got to make sure that you know your product. You got to make sure that you know the financing. You got to make sure that you know what these customers may be looking for and asking of you. Now, nobody said that you've got to learn it all before you get on the floor, before you can make a sale. It's not about that, folks. It just means you must continuously be learning. You must be continuously getting better. It's uh, what the Japanese call Kaizen, continuous improvement. And we'll talk about that later on down the road. But that continuous improvement is going to lead to the belief that you need to have each and every day and especially on Saturdays because today is when you need to bring it, right? Especially on a Saturday. Now, if you've got that belief, obviously it's going to come through. Obviously, you're going to be able to influence. Obviously, you're going to be able to make an impact on these people. And that's what we want. But the real impact on Saturday and every other day of the week is going to be caring. How much do you care? Why do you care? That's what these customers are looking for. They want to know, are you truly there to help them? Because you got to put yourself in their shoes, right? You are the salesperson. You're truly a consultant, but to them, in their eyes, you're the salesperson and you're going to be trying to get over on them. At least that's what they think. You and I both know that we are here to help these people. We are here to solve the problem that they've got going on that brought them into your location in the first place. However, they don't know that and they've got their guard up and they're trying to make sure that they're not going to get sold as much as they want that house today. They're going to be doing everything in their power to not get sold. So you showing them how much you care is the difference. There's an author by the name of Simon Sinek who has the book, Start With Why. And this guy is all over the internet and he has this quote that just, when I read that thing, it made a real impact. And he says, people don't buy what you do, people buy why you do it. So ask yourself, why are you doing what you do? Why is it that you are there trying to get a hold of these folks to come on in to see you today, Saturday, to be able to help them solve that problem, provide them the solution, why? That's what they want to know. If you can influence them with the why, if you can make them understand how important it is for you to be able to help them, then you pretty much have done your job because everything else is going to fall into place. Because once you can make these people understand that you truly care and why it is that you care, now they're going to open up their mind. They're going to open up their ears. They're going to open up their heart to you and they're going to listen to what it is that you have to say. They're going to let you guide them 
along the whole process. Now, doesn't mean they're not going to fight you. Believe me, they're going to fight you the whole way through, but it's just because they're nervous and scared. If you could show them why that you're doing this, well, then everything else just gets easier from then on in. They're going to listen to you about your company. They're going to listen to you about your product. They're going to listen to you when you advise them on how to go about purchasing that home. But up until then, if you have it, explain to them and gotten the point across as to why you are there and you're fighting an uphill battle. So just think of it this way. They're not asking you to be the smartest person today. They're simply asking you to be the person that cares. And if you can do that, everything else is just cake after that. So today, Saturday, folks, I invite you each and every one of you, each and every housing consultants out there across the country watching this, no matter where you're at, think about that. Why is it that you care? You have to answer the question, so what? To every point that you bring out today, this Saturday, to these folks, the day that they're there to make their decision, you have to ask yourself or you have to be thinking about how in the back of their mind, every sentence that comes out of your mouth, they're going to be asking themselves, so what? What does that matter to me? How does that benefit me? So be prepared with that. If you're prepared with those answers to be able to explain to them the so what's, well then you are going to be doing your job this Saturday and you are going to be all about the sale because the sale is you. It's not all those banners hanging out in your lobby. It's not about all the, the, the flyers that are out in the houses. It's not what you've posted on Facebook or anything of that. Or it is you. You are the sale. Today, Saturday, believe and care. Bring those two things to the table and you are going to make it happen today. Have a great day today, folks. Make it a great selling Saturday. And I can't wait to meet you.